Hi there, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to show you how to repair Windows 7 using the automatic repair feature. Hope you find this guide useful. If you do, please help me out by subscribing to my channel. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is put your Windows 7 install media into your computer. If you don't have uh, your Windows 7 install media, if you go onto a machine that you can boot to the desktop, um, just Google Windows 7 ISO and you can see here there's the official Microsoft website you can download the Windows 7 uh, installed disk image. Um, so you download that ISO file and then just right click on it and you can do burn to DVD. Uh, then if you reboot your machine, so I've inserted the Windows 7 media into my machine here. Just going to restart it. So once you've turned on your machine, it should ask you to press any key to boot to CD-ROM. Uh, when you see that text pop up on your screen, just press any key and it will uh, boot to, there we go, and then it will boot to the install media. Uh, the first screen, just select your language and region, English United Kingdom for me, so click next. Uh, don't click on install now, down the bottom left here, click on repair your computer. Okay, and then on this screen, if you click on Troubleshoot, Advanced Options, and then click on here, Startup Repair. Um, if you click on that, it's then going to launch an application. That application will then scan your local, locally installed Windows 7. Um, it will find any startup issues you might have, and it will automatically fix them. So if you just run that and then restart your machine and your machine will be able to boot to Windows again. If you have any questions, please post them below. But thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.